Hi, this is a book review for Ready Player Two by Ernest Klein. I went into this book so ready to be disappointed and I was so not, which is really cool. I'm gonna try to not spoil Ready Player One while we're at it. I was pretty into this book pretty quickly, but it didn't pick up until I wanna say like 140, 150 pages. So if you're someone who needs the action right away, this might not be the book for you. I really enjoy Ernest Klein's writing and I feel like the writing and the voice was exactly the same as Ready Player One, although I don't entirely remember. It just felt very similar vibes. As far as the lore goes, it's a lot less arcade things and a lot more movies and songs and immersive worlds. Like, like there's a kind of a John Hughes world that's in the suburbs of Chicago and they go to Middle Earth and things like that. People say a lot that if you liked Ready Player One that you should read Warcross or Other Way Around. I say just read Ready Player Two. Like it's really not that bad. Ella reads a sequel and enjoys it. A rare, rare occurrence. <laughs> I have more thoughts in an upcoming video, but it's coming out in like January, so you might have to wait for a minute. <laughs>